Many people now are really worried about what might happen as they get older. Will we get Alzheimer's disease? Will we start to lose our memory? Well, let me share with you some, some important steps to protect your memory. Number one, researchers in Chicago, Illinois, in the United States, discovered some important things. One of which was that people who avoid what I will call bad fat, bad fat, they actually cut their risk of Alzheimer's disease by about two thirds. What are bad fats? It's the fats in dairy products and in meat. We call them saturated fat. But the way you can tell them is that the fat, it's the fat that's very solid, like fat in cheese or fat in bacon, as opposed to liquid oils. So step number one, we want to avoid the foods like dairy products and meat that have those bad fats. Step two, there are certain foods called that, or certain fats called trans fats. Trans fats, they're also sometimes called partially hydrogenated oils. You'll see them in snack foods. Avoid those two. They're as bad as the other bad fats. Step three, be careful about metals. Iron, copper, aluminum. If you have an iron, cast iron pan, and the iron is in touch with the food, then some of the iron gets into the food. A little bit's okay. But over time, if there's too much iron, it can damage the brain. The same is true with copper, and especially with aluminum. So if I have an aluminum pan, it's only okay if it's coated, if it has a non-stick surface, and so the, the aluminum is not actually in touch with the food. The next step, though, is it's not just all food. There's also something to be said for exercise. Lace up your sneakers and go out for a run. Now, if that sounds a little bit daunting, what I suggest you do, for sh starters, is a 10-minute walk. Do it three times a week, 10 minutes, 10 minutes, 10 minutes. Next week, do it 15, 15, 15, 15 minute walk and not trudging. Get going so that your heart is beating faster. And then go up to 20, 25, 30. Once you reach 40 minutes, three times a week, a good brisk walk, that is, has been shown to reverse brain shrinkage. And finally, you must stop. You must stop working, you must stop eating, you must stop exercising even, and go to sleep. At 10 o'clock at night, lie down, turn off the light, no matter how good your book is, go to sleep. Because your brain needs sleep to recover. And in the morning, you'll feel better. So avoid the bad fats, avoid the metals, lace up your sneakers, get some sleep. That's a solution to help you to protect the brain and to prevent Alzheimer's disease too.